Hey everyone, it's Tech Kim, and I'm going to show you how to add a little snow to your Weebly website. I was inspired to do this after I had raptorized my Weebly website on Halloween, and I decided with Christmas coming up I wanted to have a little snow. Now I'm not ready to create a JavaScript on my own, so I went searching on the web and I found uh, one I liked by Ivan here. If I scroll down, he provides a demo page to see how it will look. And there it is, snow falling. I really like that um, effect, so I decided to use this. So the first thing I want to do is actually uh, download the JS file. And he actually has multiple versions of it. I'm going to pick this latest one because it was updated just 11 days ago. And all I really need to do is do File, Save As, and save it. And I'm going to go ahead and take away everything except the jQuery.snow.js. So now I've saved it locally, I need to get it on my Weebly server. Now I always have a test site that I can test things like this on. So I'm going to go to Design and Edit HTML CSS. And this is how I can add more files. I'm going to click Add File and upload the jQuery.snow.js. You'll see there it is now. Now I still don't have any snow because I haven't called it. I'm going to save this. Now if you have never saved, uh, never made a change to the HTML CSS, it's going to actually ask you to name it and I called mine Snow Theme. So the next thing we need to do is actually uh, call the jQuery. So I'm going to copy this code. And there's two ways you can do this in Weebly. If you want the snow to appear on every page, you're going to go to Settings, Search Engine Optimization, and you're going to copy and paste this code under header code. Now I only want the snow to appear on the home page, so instead I'm going to go to pages and then advanced settings and I'm going to copy this page into my header code. Oops, paste. Uh, I need to make one more change. Um, in Weebly when you upload files you have to give a path to them and it turns out they're at whatever the website is called slash files slash theme. So I'm going to copy this and add it right after the quotation mark. And now it'll know where that script is. And there's one more thing I need to add to this that calls the snow plugin here. I'm going to copy that. And again, I can put it right in the header code. And now I can save it. So as you'll see, here's my website. Um, without the snow. I haven't published it, republished it yet. So let's publish it and fingers crossed we will have snow. There it is. Great. Well, I hope you enjoy this and I'd love to hear what kind of uh, fun things you add to your websites. Good luck and happy holidays.